Texans and the Browns. The Browns are 11 and a half point favorites. This is interesting because Houston was way better yesterday than I think any of us thought. I had Houston being the worst team in the league. And while Jacksonville is not a very good team and the Urban Meyer experiment, that also might be something that um, it's one game in, so I can't uh, really make too many uh, conclusions about that. But gosh, Jacksonville was all prepared yesterday. And the Texans look good. Uh, the Texans, by the way, are leading the AFC South. Um, but I, I think this is really the, the game where we really see how Tyrod Taylor plays. Um, this is where we see if that defense can pick it up here against Cleveland. Cleveland looked excellent yesterday for three quarters. Um, unfortunately, in the fourth, they blew it. But they looked offensively they really controlled the game um we do wonder is obj is obj gonna be back for this game here we thought he was gonna we thought he was gonna be here he was on the field yesterday and then he was ruled inactive hopefully he can come back um in this game here hopefully he can bring cleveland back and get them uh, pumped up here again because we know what obj can do when he's healthy we saw what he did with the giants in the slight glimpses of cleveland we saw what he can do i, I this is a big line 11 and a half is a monster monster spread i bet cleveland can cover it though and I'm just, I'm just not sold on Houston here being able to. I think Cleveland, I think Cleveland will get to Tyrod Taylor a little bit. Not sold on Houston being able to do this two weeks in a row. If Houston does it two weeks in a row, God bless them if they're able to make this a competitive game here against Cleveland. After we all thought they were going to be the worst team in the league, but I think Cleveland is just in a better place right now. They went toe to toe with the best team in the AFC, um, and their offense really looks fantastic once again here. And if if they bring Beckham back. Who knows what they can do? So I say Baker, Chubb, the whole team. I think Cleveland is in complete control here in this game. Give me the Browns minus 11.5 over the Texans.